Welcome back to Keeping Up in Disney. If you can tell by our outfits, we've got something a little McDonald's themed for this video. Why would we have a McDonald's themed video? Oh, because we're gonna be talking about Disney McDonald's toys. I, for a long time, have been into collecting McDonald's toys. I've always liked collecting we them. We collected the Lion King ones from a couple years ago, actually. At that time, collected, I have a couple full sets of those, the live action Lion King toys from 2019. I have at least a full set of the Toy Story 4 toys from maybe a couple years ago when Toy Story 4 came out that summer. I have a lot of other assorted Disney McDonald's toys that I've just collected over the years, some other full sets too, which is like hundreds of McDonald's toys. So it's another thing that I love to collect that I've always kind of collected. These shirts actually that me and Jamie are wearing too, they were from a little like, it was a box lunch in McDonald's collab that they did for clothing and backpacks. So there was like a Happy Meal crossbody and another Egg McMuffin and McDonald's backpack too. So that was a pretty cool collab. I did get these clothes from box lunch for that. And I, I love this hoodie, this is the Hamburglar if you don't know who he is. And it's a really cool clothes collection, so check that out too if you haven't seen it yet. But we're gonna talk about today the most recent set of McDonald's Disney toys that were put out. It was, of course, for the 50th anniversary of Walt Disney World, which is like the coolest collab ever because it was right after we had just gotten back from our September trip too. And we were going to McDonald's like every single day almost, trying to get different ones, many different McDonald's. And we were doing this for like a good probably like month or like two like straight. But it was kind of worth it and fun to see the different toys that they had and just trying to collect all 50 of them. And we had just seen the statues in Disney World, so it was really cool coming back and going out and kind of like collecting those same statues. So I have here this giant Steamboat Willie bag where I have all, yes, all 50 of the McDonald's Disney 50th toys stored up. I was able to collect all of them. It was a pretty tough mission, but we're gonna open them up, lay them out, and take a look at them here now. So I'm just gonna pull out one so we can look at it. And to get a closer look at the toys, so this is kind of what they look like. So like, this is BB-8. You got the toy in there. And then there's a little stand. Which has the theme park that character is in at Disney World, which yeah, is cool. It is really cool. And then it's, so it's a little stand and a backing for the park. And there are 50 different characters. And on the back of the bag, it does say Star Wars 2 and Walt Disney World 50th. And for one like Joe Gardner, it says Pixar on the back. So it's kind of cool too. So we're gonna lay them all out, show them all off, then kind of talk about our favorites and just the toys a little bit. So here they are. We've got all 50 of the 50th toys. So, got some really cool ones, a good cast of characters. We got Mickey, Flounder, Timothy Mouse, Apu, Genie, Bambi, Celebration Dale, R2-D2, Celebration Minnie, Sebastian, Bruni, Tinkerbell, Bo Peep, Cheshire Cat, Miguel, Joe Gardner, Celebration Daisy, Celebration Goofy, Piglet, Lumiere, Frozone, Dory, Dante, BB-8, Celebration Pluto, Lady, Tramp, Jock, Rocket, Edna Mode, Jiminy Cricket, Simba, Winnie the Pooh, Cogsworth, Gus Gus, Hey Hey, Mad Hatter, Stitch, Woody, Groot, Olaf, Pua, Dumbo, Celebration Donald, Pinocchio, Pumba, Thumper, Celebration Chip, Nemo, and last but not least, Timon. So, a really cool collection of characters there, and awesome for the 50th. I think the two that are different in the parks that aren't included here, so I think 48 out of the 50 are the same, but in the parks they have the Orange Bird and Figment, who they don't have in toy forms, and they were replaced with, I know one of them is the Genie, who doesn't have a statue in the parks, and I can't remember the other one at the moment, but it's another one of them that does not have a statue in the parks that would have been Figment or Orange Bird had it been made into a toy. So I'm showing off some of my favorites, which is one, of course, Flounder. I really like Flounder. And I like the Sebastian one a lot too because it reminds me of the statue art of animation. Lady, because she's one of my favorites. Of course, Tinkerbell, and of course, this adorable Dumbo. It's so cute. I cannot handle the cuteness. 
and I actually do like the Pinocchio one because it's just like a original Disney character and they don't have a lot of like Pinocchio I feel like and of course Simba I love the Lion King and last but not least of course Winnie of the Pooh because he's always adorable so those were my favorites and some of my favorites first of course, we got Celebration Mickey Mouse with the castle behind him. He's awesome. My second one, R2-D2, because I've been into the droids lately, and this one's a really cool toy. I like him. And last, but of course not least, my absolute favorite of all of them, Celebration Dale with the castle behind him too, so he's adorable. Definitely my favorite. So we are so happy we were able to get the full set of the toys. It's awesome to have them all. Super cool for the 50th. I even do have like a couple spares of some random ones. So at some point we might try to make some ornaments or other things, but who knows, we'll see. We hope you enjoyed this video. Let us know if you got any of the collection and which one is your favorite. Thanks for checking out the toys with us. Make sure to leave a like on the video if you enjoyed, comment letting us know, and subscribe for more. Thanks for keeping up in Disney. See you soon. Thank you.